Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. In this video we will learn how we can add sniper shooter so uh, on a tower. So if uh, if you check the default properties of uh, sniper shooter in, in vector uh, the sniper shooters start walking and running and sprinting in response to player movements but uh, what we want is that we want to stay the sniper shooter at certain point like tower like uh, you saw in IGI like game and we don't want to walk or run or sprint this sniper shooter it will stay at the place and it will uh, shoot the player okay you will shoot the player so for that uh, property we will select the enemy and uh, before doing changes in enemy you have to open the prefab first and then uh, definitely you already have set up the tags for detection uh, the player tag here so that he can detect the player and then the main thing uh, here is uh, actually the uh, movement settings so in movement we will change the movement speed from walking to idle so he will not walk at all also we will make some more changes and here you can see that uh, i have changed the rotation speed walk speed etc to 0.22 you can do 0 0.1 0 0.01 0 0.02 0 0.3 whatever you want for your needs but uh, I have changed it to 0.22 and you have to change these properties as well so he can't work okay we don't need to change animator controller or FSM behaviors for this uh, property uh, after that uh, the uh, other thing is detection so he was detecting uh, in a very short area initially but what we want we want to detect the player from a large canvas so if we shoot the sniper from this place he should attack us okay so for that purpose we will select the detection tab and in detection we can debug the visual detection here you can see the area i have increased the area for sniper shooter okay and we can increase this area from uh, from actually there it is yeah here so we can increase the minimum uh, distance of detection and maximum uh, distance to detect okay also I have changed the lost target distance and I have increased this property and this property as well uh, this property I didn't changed this property I have changed I have increased some value so we uh, he will not lose us uh, the enemy uh, in a short time okay uh, after that in detection uh, we also have a combat settings and in combat settings we have to change the attack distance i have increased the attack distance so he can attack us from far away and uh, you can definitely change your own settings and I also combat distance I have changed to 10 okay minimum distance I have changed it to something higher as well so that's it so now uh, our shooter is ready and hopefully when we will attack our shooter although the uh, visualization is not very uh, good as per the AAA games we should have a nice tower actually with the uh, lower uh, boundaries and then so that we can see the this shooter but unfortunately the given tower is a little bit uh, uh, have high boundaries so in this case uh, I'm just giving you an idea you can definitely change the tower and you can create a better sniper uh, experience okay so now let's see, see uh, how it will react so for example 
if uh, we are far away from the sniper and you can see he is uh, at the higher level and we are at the lower level and uh, if he detect us if, if we shoot him uh, because we didn't set the detection from sound so now you can see if we shoot him he will detect us and he will definitely shoot us you can see yeah you can see he is shooting us and he will kill us so he killed us from higher range and he is still on the tower he didn't fell from the tower he didn't walk he didn't run as well uh, so this is the setting for sniper shooter uh, in the same video we will also set up the stair okay because in igi you can see that uh, we have the stairs property and our player can uh, climb up to stairs step up to stairs and then he can kill the enemy so for that purpose we have stairs uh, ready stairs in invector uh, third person shooter folder and then basic locomotion and prefabs and then I think environment and here you can see a lot of assets here here we have a ladder action so we can place ladder here and definitely this ladder is small in size the one main thing you have uh, you should be should keep in uh, it in notice that this trigger is very important so this trigger should be uh, towards outside so we can just uh, rotate this stair like this and we can rotate it to 180 degree actually right way and then we can place it at the spot we want so let's add it uh, somewhere here maybe you can definitely change the mesh of the stair and I will not show you that process you already know that how we can change the meshes of certain um, prop, uh, meshes uh, of certain models so I will not show you that process I will just make it uh, yeah, bigger so that we can climb up to the stairs so if we you can definitely zoom and then you can arrange it accordingly okay just place it here and definitely if you have custom tower you can delete this stair as well and then you can place the new stair and I'm not uh, doing that thing I will just place it here so that it should not make any difference so yeah it's a little bit small so we can just scale it I think uh, yeah now it's fine it's a little bit more bigger yeah and yeah that's nice I think so let's see let's play the game and hopefully our stair will work and we can climb the stair as well so let's see what will happen so yeah you can see the stair here we'll come here and we will press E E is for action in in vector so after E we can just uh, move upward like this and here you can see that we should need bigger stairs so little bit thick like this it will work so now hopefully it will work sorry I don't know why 
okay so uh, let's move and now we will press e you can definitely arrange it perfectly okay i'm not doing that we are just getting an idea how it will look like and because the enemy was there that's why we are feeling some uncomfortable ability so sniper will definitely shoot us if he got any time so uh, that's it for this video we have successfully added sniper shooter and stair as well uh, definitely you can improve it as per your need I have given you an idea In next video we will move further and uh, we are just going to finish this course in uh, i think three four more videos thank you very much allah hafiz